everyone, it's Etiquette Connoisseur. Today I am addressing 10 things that are very annoying for an event. Say you are being invited to lunch or to dinner. These are 10 things that annoy people, so try not to do them. The first would be uh, sending the RSVP at the last minute. You were invited to an event. You have maybe a week notice. Try to answer when you know, as soon as you know, the same day or maybe the next day. Don't wait until the day before or the day of the event because the host will be wanting to know how many people they're going to be uh, having seating for or how much they're catering for etc so try to be considerate about that and reply at a reasonable time if you have an event that's six months in advance okay you could take a couple weeks to reply even a month but no later than that. Number two is putting your purse on the seat. When you get there, there would be other people joining you on the seats next to you. So please do not put your purse on the seat next to you, taking up space. And also, do not put it on the table it's just not the place for it where i would recommend would be at the back of your chair uh, so that you would be seated in front of the purse so try to take a purse that's not too large that would be good enough to put on the seat behind you uh, if you hang your purse on the chair, it may disturb the service. It may cause a little bit of an accident, so try not to do that. Number three is wearing too much cologne or perfume. Cologne for men, perfume for women. Try not to do that. Just have a light spray if you're going among others, especially to eat. The uh, you know, the odors of the perfume or the cologne can be disturbing for the food. And some people are irritated and they may be sneezing or coughing if you have too much on. So be aware of that. Number four is using your phone while in the company of others. You are with a friend or friends, but you are talking on the phone and they are there waiting for you. I personally have had this happen to me where I'm in the car with someone or I'm at coffee or lunch and they are constantly on the phone. That's rude. Please do not do that. If you need to take a call, excuse yourself. Say, please excuse me. I need to take this and then go somewhere where you would have quietness and privacy and have your phone call. Try to cut it a little shorter because you need to come back to your company. Number five would be bragging. Talking too much about what you have, where uh, you live, how much money you make, etc. Try to not do that. Talk about things in general. Uh, try to be uh, somebody who is interested rather than interesting, if you know what I mean. Be interested in the other person. Number six is connected. Making it all about yourself. People are talking, but you bring the conversation back to yourself. It's okay uh, once or twice to say something, 
about yourself obviously we all may have a little input where we can make an example of ourselves but try not to constantly make um, connection in the conversation with yourself try to let it be about the other person uh, number seven is when you're ordering please don't say can i get can i get a glass of wine can i get fries with that say may i please have a glass of wine may i please have fries with the order okay be sure to thank the server when they serve you when you're leaving thank them number eight is sniffing very loudly or blowing your nose at the table or in company many people are disturbed by hearing a lot of mucus in your throat in your nose you have a cold excuse yourself please excuse me and go where they cannot witness it they cannot hear it and blow it out um get it out of your system and then come back number nine would be eating too loudly chewing too loudly like this some people do this and they are not aware because they've developed the habit right they've developed the habit of like that and it really is disturbing to other people try to chew quietly you will take longer to chew and swallow but please do it it's considerate and number 10 is picking your teeth at the table please don't do it excuse yourself again please don't sit there with the napkin in front of your mouth we all know what you're doing the napkin in front of the mouth for a long time we know you're picking your teeth and some people just can't stand the thought of it they get um, they get a vision of the stuff in your teeth and it just doesn't feel good to other people also you cannot readily see everything that's in your teeth so excuse me i'll be right back you don't need to say what you're doing just go look at your teeth in the mirror and take everything out and then come back to your seat so those were 10 annoying things that people do to others at an event so i hope you would consider your um your people your host your uh other the guests all around you and avoid doing these 10 things thank you for listening have a nice day i'll see you next time